Porkbelly. Police are still trying to catch the mysterious underground bandits. <laughs> There it is! The most powerful, large, uh, pointy thing! Missile! It's a missile in the world! Was that supposed to happen? Now don't think of it as an SUV. Think of it as an insult you drive. The police are offering $500 to anyone who can help solve these totally freaky and bizarre crimes. <laughs> For the last time, Johnny, the underground bandits are not mole people! Then I'll prove it, Dookie Boy, with the mole people bait. That's you. Then capture the crime digitally, collect $500, buy 20 video games, and, if you play along, a steak. Come get me, mole people! I'm full of macho, leathery biker goodness! Isn't that your dad's new camera he told you, touch it and die? Yes, but notice how I'm not actually physically touching it. Ah, the camera! It's gone! My butt! It's naked! Ah, naked butt! <laughs> Mole people? That's the most unscientific thing I've ever heard. You know, it could be mole people. You cannot be my super genius prodigy twin sister. Sibling match positive. I need the keys to the atomic earth dozer before. Johnny! Where's my new camera? Yeah, uh, it was more people, Dad. Thieves of the Earth's crust. Pirates of the subterranean. They took your camera. We tried to stop them, but... Fine, okay. Well, then get me my camera back from the mole people before dinner, or no video games, no comic books, and no... Uh, Duke! <laughs> Until you're 30! Oh, and dinner's at 6. a meatloaf. You can have the keys to the dozer if you do us one small tiny scientific favor. You want me to eat salt? It's not salt. They're microphysic haughty body flakes. They genetically adjust your body to maximum teenage hotness that will attract super cuties like <sighs> Gil next door. I eat the salt, then you help me locate Mole City and give me the dozer so I can get back Dad's camera and defeat... Yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> Too much female growth hormone. What have you done? He, she is hideous! Relax, you talking hairball. It's a micro dosage and only temporary. <laughs> <laughs> a sonar scan shows a hollow pocket here. It's probably the sinkhole that sucked down the camera. Or... Mole City! Or a sinkhole! <laughs> ha! It is I, Bling Bling Boy, the world's youngest and evilest mine. What now, Eugene? Bling Bling Boy, I have changed my name to Bling Bling Boy. And unless you, Susan Hess, have dinner with me on a date... Blah. I will destroy Pork Belly with my... Don't you cut... Like I was saying... The Taser Laser, Wapper Zapper, and the Zing Ray. But only use them if the mole people are aggressive. Sing! Oh! It's going to take you a while to get down there, but don't go full speed or you'll damage the delicate... Lithosphere. Ten minutes later... More minutes later. How are you doing? Are you used to it? Hi, honey. How are the kids? Oh, Johnny's looking for my new camera, and the girls haven't blown up a thing all day. That's great. And dinner will be ready in about a half hour. I'm making a meatloaf. <laughs> Jump out, show the mole people we mean no harm, grab the camera, and get home for dinner. Right. We come in peace and only want what's rightfully your dad. Surrender, mole people! Or face our wrath! Whoa. 
Didn't see that coming. Okay, okay, let's not freak out. I mean, how dangerous can mole people be? Our security has been breached by the surface dwellers! You know, the kid in that mud over there. So, we must speed up our attack on the Earth's surface! Okay, we can freak out now! And with our mole booster rockets, we can blow a hole big enough in the surface to unleash our mole army! And nothing can stop us! We've got to do something. Okay, we catch a fishing boat to Iceland, moles hate bright light, and we'll carve out a living making elixirs for the locals. Shouldn't we try to help Johnny? He is our brother. Susan Tess, I command you to have dinner with me or face my wrath! Do you still have your evil Surface Smasher 9000 you used to brag about? Oh, uh-huh, yeah, why? Small people, stand down, for I am here to... Surrender! Please don't hurt me, I bruise easy. <laughs> when should we begin the attack on the surface, sir? Oh, I don't know, five minutes, I want to get a haircut. I want to look great when we take over the Earth. <laughs> bright light! Bright light! Hey, there's my dad's camera. Uh, Johnny, your sisters. His sisters? Don't talk to me about his sisters. They use their only brother as a personal test tube and turn me into a canine freak. They told me to give you this salt. <laughs> Yet I do love them so. In just two minutes, we will begin the phase when moles rule the earth and nobody can stop us. You already said that. I did? Really? Uh, well, it's true! Now it is you who cannot stop us! Correction! It is now back to where we cannot stop you! Um... Run! Nothing can stop me! <laughs> Didn't I say that? I did it! He's right. Nothing can stop them. I never pictured it in this way. A picture? Come on, buddy. One more for old time's sake. Oh, my eye! Uh, that's not good. <laughs> say cheese! Stop the flashing weapon of death! I give up. I want to take the surface of the Earth! Please! Dinner time! We'll never make it back in time. The dozer is too slow. All it needs is a little boost. And remember, everyone on Earth has these flashing weapons of death! <laughs> I will have revenge! I will! Maybe. I'll sleep on it. Johnny, where's my camera? <laughs> Here's a camera, Dad. Hope we're not late. And this is Eugene. I guess Susan invited him to dinner. Bling, bling, boy! Uh... <clears throat> Sorry, it, it, it's Bling Bling Boy. Oh, great! Cause I made a meatloaf! <laughs> Consider this pool of mud my way of saying, You can't fly! Kids, don't try this at home. <laughs> Boy, no fly, but my turn. Um, what's with your freaky sisters? They're waiting for Gil. Hi, Gil. Woohoo! Hey, Johnny. <laughs> 
Turbo Love Potion would get him interested in you not, hotties. <laughs> Level Love Gum. It will mutate Gil's attraction cells and make him fall in love with us. Um, didn't Dad say no more DNA experiments on the neighborhood kids? Yes, but how will he find out? He won't. As long as you mutate our DNA so we can fly, give me five bucks and admit you're both boogerheads. Are you blackmailing us? Yeah, big time. We went too far with the blackmailing thing. I know that. Hi, Gail. Hi, Susan. Mary, there's something I've always wanted to tell you. Yes, Gil? I love... I love... So, if we give you the power to fly, you must capture Monkey Gil and bring him back to the lab so we can change him back and not get busted by Dad. Deal. But flying is so three hours ago. So make Dookie fly, but give me shape-shifting powers, hurricane hands, and you still have to admit your boogerheads. Forget it! I'm in downtown Port Valley where nothing can stop mutant skater monkey boy. The governor's called in SWAT teams to tranquilize the dangerous skating primate and ship him to a top-secret government lab to do painful experiments on him. Okay, we'll mutate you. And? We're boogerheads. I'll write that, but we want cool costumes, too. From now on, you are to address me as Johnny X. Never! Uh, this isn't going to hurt us, right? No, just you. Hey, I'm flying. I can go places no dog has ever gone before. Don't even think about it. Shape-shifting powers, go! Just get Gil. Hey! I'm really getting the hang of this flying thing! The mutant monkey boy is destroying our way for us to town! Can't anything get him down? Shape shifting powers go again! It's time, monkey boy, to end your reign of apple throwing terror! <laughs> the mutant talking elephant is about to stop the monkey boy! It says here we're supposed to capture a mutant monkey boy. Must have been a typo. Um, well, this isn't according to plan. No, but I'll catch Gil once I bust out of here with hurricane hands! You know, you could have just changed into a snake and slithered out. But I wouldn't have trapped monkey boy! We've got the mutant monkey boy and we're bringing him in. Don't lick yourself! Get him! But I need more mutant powers! Lower posterior energy bursts? If we're going up against the military, we need to be able to blast out of any situation! <laughs> I'm not eating that. But you have to admit his accuracy is impressive. Ow! I mean... Hi, sweethearts! Johnny, you look ridiculous. Ooh, ooh, cake! Tastes funny. And here's a monkey boy update. We're taking the monkey boy for intense and probably painful testing. We want to find out how he could be used for military purposes or for a reality TV series. We're taking him to Area 51.1, a super secret... Don't say where we're taking him! Don't hit me, that hurt! What do you mean, like this? He looks familiar. Who does Monkey Boy remind you of? Nobody! Gotta go, Dad! Bye! What 
is that flavor. <laughs> All right, who thought it was a good idea to feed him apples for dinner? Your flying stinks. Oh, perhaps you'd rather hitch a ride on one of those other flying dogs. We've uploaded the floor plan of the facility. Gil is being held on the southeast corner, block 13. And fly low or you'll be picked up on radar. Don't worry, we are practically invisible. We are the boy in a cool outfit on a flying dog. Hit the alarms! I'm gonna take that as a bad sign. Well, let's see if they can take this! Shape-shifting powers, go! Come with me if you want to live, and get back to normal, and not have painful experiments done on you! Back off! I have super mutant powers! That makes three of us. Hey, you have mutant powers too? That's right. It's a top secret project where they take it. Don't tell them the secret stuff. <laughs> we saw you use your shape shifting and hurricane powers downtown, and now they're neutralized. But you didn't see my newest power. Flaming power boots. We're still working on that technology. Ah! I'm not afraid to use this. I said I wasn't afraid to use you. Come with us, please. Hang on to my... Home, Super Dookie, and step on it! I mean it! Step on it! Wow! Mutants locked, ready to fire. This is Dookie to Johnny. We're going to need a turbo boost. And make it a big one! Over. Well, didn't see that coming. Monkey Boy is under control, and there's no truth to rumors that other mutants freed Monkey Boy. Or that we're lying about mutants. Oh, oh look at that. Where did that come from? <clears throat> We've got to go. Bye. Oh, thank goodness we'll never see that Monkey Boy ever again. Hi, Gil! Hey, Johnny. Mutants, don't ever let me catch you girls messing with DNA. Look, Johnny ate his entire plate of beans. All day, gotta go, bye! He's gotta blow! Girls! So, before we see your experiments on molecular fusion, I'd like to introduce some new students. Mr. Black and Mr. White. No way! The government cheated, set to steal our experiments for their secret covert operations. No, dude, we're here for a righteous education and to meet babes. Aunt Miss X and Miss Z. No way! Those are two cyborgs sent by some evil dude to steal our experiments to take over the world! If you shut up, I'll go out with you. They're cool! Now, today's first experiment comes from Susan and Mary Test. The Alchemy 5000. Since the Middle Ages, man and girls have tried to alter the molecular structure of ordinary metal and transform it into precious metal. <laughs> The Alchemy 5000? That is your project? A pathetic medieval obsession of trying to turn metal into gold? Um, yeah. <laughs> Personal engraving is extra. Hmm. Hmm. It's just a milkshake. And it has milk in it. And we shook it. Don't do it! Nothing is worth it! We'll increase your testosterone level so you can grow a mustache. So Sweet! Okay, give me the shake. <laughs> Shows muscle mass increased by 800% and a height differential. Oh, girls! <laughs> Okay, where is it? Ooh, buff lamp. How many times have your mother and I told you no precious metal-changing devices in this house? 
Professor Slopsink called and said if this fell into evil hands, it could be used for evil things. Now get rid of it before dinner or no lab time for a month. One month! Okay, we gotta trash this thing. Thanks, cuties! I blame you for this. <laughs> Susan and Mary Jess. The only two minds on Earth almost as smart as mine own, but not quite as evil. And now that I have your gold-making thingy... Give it back, Eugene. Never! And it's Bling Bling Boy! What's the evil plot this time? Oh, I'm going to hook your precious gold-making machine to my super laser and turn Pork Belly into my personal treasure chest. But I won't do it if Susan goes out with me and we're boyfriend-girlfriend. What? Gross, no way. You will be mine, Susan Test. <laughs> How can we get the Alchemy 5000 back and destroy it by dinner? Give me extreme kung fu powers and a baby pet triceratops, and we're in. Yeah! Using these extreme kung fu powers, you must defeat Eugene's ninja cyborgs, grab the Alchemy 5000, and get back before dinner. Yeah, great story. Now load us up! Begin kung fu power simulation. <laughs> Silly me! Wrong program. Boy to his parents' private island, 30 miles off the coast. I preset the coordinates into the hydro cruiser, which you know comes complete with nitro rope, foam, and licorice if you get hungry. Here's a funny thing. I've decided not to risk my life over a chubby kid obsessed with gold and Susan! The island is full of tall, fresh, never been peed on trees. Oh, yeah, okay, move over. I'm in. Test of my evil powers will convince Susan Test to accept my invitation of love. Sir, we're not 100% sure that the laser fits through the. Silence! Don't make me cranky! Mom, I'm studying. Girls, dinner will be ready in an hour. Is that machine destroyed? Almost. And where's your brother? He took Dookie for a walk. He said he'd be home before dinner. He better be home before dinner. <laughs> Wait, this fun. Small watercraft approaching. Destroy it. <laughs> Uh, do you know what you're doing? Yes, I'm pushing colorful buttons. Dad, ah, we're a large city duck! This looks promising, yet at the same time, disturbing. Dinner's almost done, so let's do this. I say we split up. You go check out that large, menacing-looking fake volcano, and I'll check out that forest full of fresh trees. Copy that. <laughs> Johnny, hurry! Get the Alchemy 5000 and get home! Don't worry, Psycho Sisters. With my new ninja prowess, there's no way Bling Bling Boy can stop me! Whoa. Didn't see that coming. Do we have a date? Why don't you just get some therapy and come back to school? Is Slopsink still sore about my thesis eating his hand? Yeah. Then never! And now I want more than a date. I want a kiss. And it had better be big and smoochy. Come to rescue me. I really tried not to. Oh, and I made a phone call, too. 
Okay, I'm out of here. You may have one this round, Johnny Chest, but you won't stop me from turning Party Belly into gold!